This video is to show you how you can use your phone to control the media on your computer. Um, a lot of the time, if you're playing music or playing movies on your computer, you don't want to have to get up and, and grab the keyboard and grab the mouse. So you can actually set up a program called Gmote on your phone, and um, it will let you uh, pause, play, next track, track listing, control all the media of movies or music uh, through your computer with your phone. So um, on the computer, just get the server started, like so. So that's running, and now we need to connect to the server on our phone. So choose Gmote right here, and here's our remote control. So um, if we want to connect, go to the menu, find server. Here's our server right there that I set up earlier. Connect. So now I'm connected. And I want to browse. And show all the files on the computer. So these are the files that are on my computer. Um, it says song here. Songs. Okay, all I have is 50 cent right now. Okay, so okay, so right here I've chosen to play it on the computer at the top, and then at the bottom here I just pick the song I want to play. So it plays through the computer. And if I want, I can fast forward. Next track. Pause. Play. And stop. OK, so that's music. Um, say I wanted to actually play it through my phone. If I'm out around, I want to play through the phone instead of through the computer. So I'll go back to my track listing here. Pick the song. Pick a song again. At the top, I'll change it to phone instead of computer. And at the bottom, um, bottom here, I'll just pick a song. And I, when I click it, it should play through my phone now. There we go, so it's playing on the phone. And you can still pause and play and, and do your volume and everything through here. Um, so if you want to stop that. And say instead we want to play a movie. So we'll go into here. Let's find a movie here. Um, Okay, so we'll pick Office Space. So we click on Office Space right there. And up it comes. And we can still fast forward. Next track. Next track. Pause. Play. So I've got the volume down here, and so let's stop that and hit the power button to turn the video off. And then the last thing is um, it's a remote touchpad as well. So if we go to the menu down here and then go to touchpad, now my phone is a mouse touchpad for my computer. So if I move my thumb around here, see the mouse moving on the screen with it. So there you go, left and right, up and down, all around. So you can go all around your computer screen and use your computer with your phone. Um, if you want to select something, you just click on your tap on your phone and select it. Um, so let's open up the internet here. 
So I tap on it. It opens up Google Chrome. I go down to search bar here. Tap on that. Then I want to type. So at the top here, I hit the keyboard on my phone. Keyboard pops up, and I just turn it this way to change the orientation so I can type on it. Try and do this with one hand. So then I type in, say I want to search for the program I'm using, Gmote. G M O T E. So then it comes up on the screen there. And then on my phone, I just hit enter. And then it brings me to search results. And get rid of the keyboard, turn it back, and then I keep using it as a mouse. So this could also be used in a car. If you have a computer in your car, you can control all the media through there. Play, pause, stop, all the videos. Um, or you can just use your phone as a remote in the car to, to hit the buttons that way. Um, and yeah, so that's pretty much everything that Gmo does.